Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to our third part of Oxygen and Not Included. You guys have been really loving the game, and so have I. What a fantastic little alpha game we have here. Uh, so we ended last episode making this giant wall of storage. Oops, don't want to sweep it. And uh, we got some. We got quite a bit of the research done last time too, with our supercomputer and our regular little farva station there. So this episode, what I want to do is I want to start trying to refine stuff. Maybe <laughs> I'm kind of concerned. Like uh, we need to we need to sit down and oop power switch. Oh, this stuff's gonna be so much fun. Uh, I, this is as far as I've played too. So all of this stuff is new to me. What I ideally want to do is get everything cleaned up, get everything built up, and everything rolling and going right now. But we are out of LJ again <laughs> surprise surprise we're out so let's build up and ooh, that's not too good there is oh this is gonna be interesting carbon dioxide is gonna flow all the way down our staircase into this little area but that is going we have the LJ terrarium so that should be uh, converting the carbon dioxide at the bottom of our little area into more breathable air so we're gonna make this go through that's a good oxygen pit and I can get the I can harvest that should I? I kind of want to dig it up. Let's dig it up. I'm gonna dig it up. And oh, we could we could do both. <laughs> we could do both, and we get back home for ourselves. So let's do that. Then we're gonna go ahead and roll through there and roll through here. I guess we'll have to do all of that. Come in here. Is that? Let's dig to. Oh, look at this. We can make a we can make a pipe, and we can pipe down that water into our our water hole. Mm, that sounds fun. Now, do we want to make? I don't know where to make a watering hole. I really want to make one though. Cause that sounds really neat. Like a big water storage zone. You guys knew um, before I before I was a full time YouTuber, I was actually a hydraulic and hydrologic engineer. So I worked a lot with flowing rivers and, and water. So I really love working with water in in games, as long as it's good water in games. Because some water in games is really really bad. Uh, like Skyrim. Skyrim's water mechanics were horrible, and uh, so were um, uh, what was that game? City Skylines. That room really bothered me because they they prided themselves on really good oh we got a new duplicate uh we, they prided themselves on really good water mechanics and then you, you like the boats would drive way high in the air and you could make a dam and it didn't flow right it was anyway um i know fluids are very difficult things to do in games oh the k so we have three dudes we have howard celeste and leah athletics that could be kind of cool we have another dig a uh, diggy 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 celeste i think we might go with celeste another digger diver's lungs what Oh wow, <laughs> that's kind of cool. Uh, and a grease, go grease monkey, huh? So I don't know who to take. I think Celeste. And Celeste is now Marcus. Cool. So we're gonna print you, and you are gonna be welcomed into our colony of misfits and and duplicates. Yay! Something else happened. Ooh, research. I think. Cool. Now uh, let's just take gas piping too. Might as well take the low end stuff. All right, that looks good up top. It looks really awesome up top. Um, and that's still a problem there. I really want... Okay, we're out of oxygen. Come on, dudes. Yeah, n n none of the oxygen makers are oxygenizing right now. So let's prioritize this stuff up. And we'll come up and we'll go in here. And we'll get all that. Whee! Man, this is cool too, that oxalite. Yeah, they're, they're coming way up to the top to get a, a breath of fresh air. I guess we could crack into this thing, too, on this side, because there's a lot of air in there if we need to. We'll see. I am kind of wanting to make, because th these guys are getting, if we look at them, uh, they're getting a little bit stressed out. And if we look at why, uh, BB, where are you? Marcus, Marcus, you're not supposed to be in there. You know better than that. Marcus, oh, Marcus. Okay, Marcus, you're supposed to be harvesting. Uh, let's make you, I don't know, that'll work, whatever. Whee! Okay, BB's gonna run in her treadmill now. Cool, yeah, look, oh, cycle report. Did we get anything today? We didn't. Wow, that day went, like, super fast. <laughs> uh, ooh, look at these, they're, they're ready to harvest. Yay! Harvest our, oh, don't deconstruct that thing. Harvest our meal wood, because it looks so neat to me. And it's daytime. I'm gonna slow back down into slow mode, just because I want to. Harvesting it, you're, you picked up your nasty little trash compartment. And I guess you're gonna store that in the ration box, aren't you? You know what? So we have all of our foods, <laughs> we have our regular storage down here. That's awesome. I love this, this makes me so happy having a giant storage room. 
You guys have no idea. And this thing needs light. Uh, we gotta get light down in there, though. How do we do that the best? Let's run the light down the staircase and through the floor. That's not important right now. Okay, that's just goop. Get rid no, no. Dig that up. Dig these up. And then we're gonna run power line. And shoop, and shwing, and shoop. Oh, that sound is fantastic. Nice. I could do that all day. That sound is so great. Oh, this one. Oh, that one's ready to go too. Ah, uh, food. We're back up to eighteen thousand. Excellent. So we we can start changing to have one person cook and do nothing but cooking. We have a little bit of meal lice in there, and that's gonna work. Okay, we picked up the LJ. We got the first of the LJ ready to go. We got some muck root. We have no LJ. Shoots! I guess we're gonna use it all up. Wow. I guess we could take this stuff too. Music. Music is close inside and not so much out there. Oh, we got this too. Didn't see that before. Very neat. Right, we should probably pump out the gas. Oh, man, that's gonna be fun when we... So, uh, you know what? Let's just speed it up. I'm gonna let the game run. Uh, they're gonna they're gonna harvest everything now. Okay, so we got some stuff going on. Look at this. So a lot of our oxygen. There's a little bit of oxygen from him. A little bit of Auto Dave's got some grimy, nasty hands going on. Uh, the it is working. So it's pulling out like all of the carbon dioxide and it's making it breathable and good stuff down here in the terrarium. That's cool. Uh, we do need a little bit more stuff. We'll remove that. We did get our research done, so let's slow it down. We're gonna get our research. Uh, we could do for, uh, percolation. We did the sanitation sciences is the next one I wanted, and our research is complete. Building is entombed. Oh, that's gross. Let's get rid of that. I guess it fell from the sky when we did that. So dirt. Very neat. We still don't have enough briar seeds for these. That's too bad. And this is working nicely down here. Very good. So it's nighttime again. <laughs> we, we skipped a lot of the day. A lot got done. Uh, but I'm gonna skip the night again. We'll skip until we get all caught up. I have to get caught up. Like I want all everything stored and oh, you know what? We could just prioritize somebody's storing. What would it be called? Sweeping, I think. Oh, BB's awesome at sweeping because of the athletic skills. That's cool. Okie dokie. So I made Chenas our complete sweeper, and what that does is it collects all of the resources that are laying about, and we're gonna bring those back into the base now. Hopefully, Janos will do that. Oh, look at it go. Yes. Picking everything up, sucking it up, and storing it into the storage place. Good. That is awesome. I love how they just run around. It's so great. And, oh, you know what? We need to unstore these. Ooh. Huh. <laughs> I don't know about that. Um, I don't know if I want to sweep in there right now. Or take those apart. I'll let her get caught up. What I was planning on doing was just letting this go. Uh, and then we'll delete these and I want to make uh, food areas. Actually, let's do that right now. We have um, ration box fridge Okay uh, Drastically increases where where is it? Oh, it's probably furniture There's the mess table. So I kind of so these are these are interesting um, our people are too tall So if we had like a mess area that they could go eat every time they wanted to eat would be something fun to do Maybe up here uh, we could do that um Let's get everything else finished first, and then we'll get a mess hall up and running. This is kind of neat. They deliver all of the goods first. They got sand. Oh, you're gonna store it, huh? Nice. They're they're working on it. Good. This is great. I, I find it funny that they still haven't dug in here, but I think that's okay. It's kind of just a goofy deal. And now Marcus is working. So I kind of wish this was higher now that I look at it, but it's all right because it's it's actually working. We're taking out a lot of the. The carbon dioxide's flowing down the tunnel and we're getting inside, so that's really good. Uh, we're also producing a lot of oxygen and our pressure is a little bit, is getting high. You see how high that is? Uh, so eventually we're gonna have to let it out. Maybe we could turn one of these off. Let's just disable that building for right now and I think we'll be okay. I think we're all right, building entombed. I did that already, whatever. Let them roll. Get everything stored up. Look at them go. They're all sweeping up the place. Nice. This is what I needed to do. Just a little bit of, little bit of sweeping priority. 
Okay, so we got uh, insufficient resources. Our oxygen makers are back out of oxygen, but I think we have enough. Like, uh, it's we're still pressurized really high, so I think we're all right with that. Uh, also, no research, because that just finished. Which is good. Combustion, we can make that. I'm kind of concerned about this, because it burns coal. Uh, pressure management, this could be good, too. Gas valve in pipes to maintain. Okay, we got the fine dining. Insulation is heat. We have the med bay uh, mesh tile. Hmm. To enclose. Whoa. That's kind of cool. Rejuvenator. Greatly accelerates regeneration. Okay, so that's a healing thing. Uh, wow. Man, we're, we're flying through all, like all of the research. Let's just get the temperature. Actually, what's this one? Yeah, let's do that one first. I don't know. I honestly don't know what to do, but I just want everything cleaned up since we have so much junk laying around. So I'm just gonna make everyone do it. I turned off the the food machine. Micro musher is gone, and everyone seems to be collecting stuff and putting it in right now. Uh, also, we're out of oxygen, so I need to I need to get some of that. Uh, we have the the slime down here, and we need to get rid of that. Uh, also, this stuff up here needs to be taken care of. So I'm gonna prioritize some of this a little bit higher level, so they can get up there and get our LJ, and then come back down. Just one at a time. There you go, Jen. Do your work. Do your work. Doing your thing. When you're doing your thing. Oh, picking up the dirt. See, that's awesome. That's one thing I miss in RimWorld, or what RimWorld needs, is they're up here, and then they grab something, and then they take it home. Look at that. Grab it, and you're gonna take it home, because you knew that your work here was done, which is awesome. It's like totally awesome. There's some LJ again. Good, and you picked it up. And now we should have oxygen again. And it's all working. And somebody else just leveled up. Another skill increase. Good work. Look at this. It's it's doing the we're doing the thing. So that's working. Oh man, they just totally ripped this apart. Good work, Farba. Get us a leader at cola. There you go. Whee! Hey, new dupe available again. So who do we get this time? A tinkering, a medicine, and learning grease monkey. We get an early bird or a night owl. I prefer the night owl myself. Uh, tinkering cook. Ooh, we could do a cook. A dedicated cook sounds good. Sir Bert. Actually, that works pretty well. Because we got Bert Macklin as a patron. Cool, so Bert Macklin, welcome to the party. You are gonna be no generating a power. You're gonna be our cook. How's that sound? Wait, <laughs> oh, you dirty little, you dirty little cheater face. Oh, I didn't realize, cause you, we picked you cause you could cook and then you have gastrophobia, so you can't cook. You little nerd, you little nerd. I don't like you. You know what? You're gonna be our new dedicated sweeper. That's all you're gonna do with your life. Sweep and build, sweep and build. And the chainhouse can go back and do other stuff, like research, generated power, just kidding. Harvest, all the other good junk, composting, art skills, just everything. Oh man, they're building stuff now. How is that light working It's not plugged in? That was weird. <laughs> that was crazy. And now they're ready to go to bed again. Great. Just awesome. I love how the batteries flicker at night too, isn't that cool? Oh, and these are ready to harvest. Wait a minute, blossom seed. Oh, it died. It's too bad. So let's harvest these up for our little dupes. Running low on food again. Eek. Don't like that. Can we put a... Oh, we don't have any more. There we go. Power's coming up. I should really make more power in other parts of the base. Just for good reasons. Uh, this See, this all was completed, and then, like, nobody did it. Like, all of the materials were here, because nobody built because of the priority system. Ah, oh, come on. Finish it up, BB. Finish it up. There you go. There you go. And we got power. So these things are going to produce at even a better rate now. Good job, Marcus. Finishing the job. These are cool. Got some power. We're making breathable gas. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, indeed I do. And that's... I like that system. It's really neat. We could put another one in here if we wanted to. Cool. Research just completed itself again. Med bay. I mean, we we're gonna get all of the med med stuff, research, whatever it's called, done. I've been trying to think, like, how do we, how do we do this as like an airlock? Like, we want our air to go into here, right? We have to have our air go into here um, to get collected, but we want to dig deeper and we want to dig to the side so we can purify this this junk and the water up here. I think what we need to start with is a pump. 
And if we can let our, if our guys ever go in there. See, they have to finish this up first. They have to finish up all of the hauling. And then once they do that, then we can we can check out our, our new thing. Um, it looks like they're about ready to be done. Like literally, that's that's it. <laughs> wow, I wasn't expecting that. So they're they're actually done hauling now. Are they packing up water and just storing it? Oh man, why is this food edible? Mush bar, field rations. Oh, we got a lot of junk in there, huh? It's almost full, but I didn't think it would be. Hey, okay. So that's it. Uh, that's all of the hauling done. They're gonna come up here and they'll work in that. Um, we need to make a pump now. We can do plumbing. There's all sorts of good stuff. So we, we have to make a cistern first. Kind of like the idea of sending our guys in here, clearing it up. No, I don't know if I want to do that. Because <sighs> this, I like this little area. Maybe let's do it in here. Should we bust this open and make a big water puddle? Yeah, we're gonna do that. We're gonna, we're gonna do that. Totally gonna do that. Oh boy! <laughs> so their bedding area is out of oxygen. Oh, that's not good. I'm out of, oh great. I'm out of juice again. <laughs> we're gonna have to go back up top. Um, here I am thinking we're doing good. So I need water to make the, the new hy hydrolysis? Hy hydro system, whatever it's called. But we need to get all of that. So let's let's prioritize that. We gotta get our 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 stuff in there. That's the wrong button. Give me an eight. Give me an eight. Give me an eight. Give me an eight. Okay, everybody up. Everybody awake. <laughs> That's funny that they're dying in their beds because they don't have enough oxygen. There should be enough oxygen at low levels. Hmm. That is interesting. How's this? That's almost all bad air right there. Let's close that off. I guess the bad air is coming down from these. There we go, we got more algae. Building entombed. It's, that thing's still... Wow, so do I need to turn anything on? That's that's weird, like, where is that bad gas coming from? Oh, up here. That's where it's coming from. This is a big puddle of carbon dioxide. Shoot! Oh, I guess we didn't crack that open before. But then now that's filtering down our stairs. Yikes! Yikes, it's coming into there. That's what we need, like, a, a better door for. Huh. Well, we could always make a new one. Ooh, we got a new composter coming up. I'm still surprised that this hasn't been done, like it needs to be. And we have our oxygen being made, so everything's okay with that. We're gonna build up the walls, change the walls out, and now we're gonna build a staircase along the side. I also wanna come in here and just mine the whole thing out the best I can. And then we're gonna use this as a new water bay. I'm gonna move this thing over here. We're gonna move this, uh, this thing right here. And we're gonna put in a cooking station right next to it. And a refrigerator right next to that. Or two. And we'll power those up. It's still interesting that we have one person with giant uh, skills running on the treadmill that's powering our entire base, isn't it? That's funny. Research complete. Pressure management. We get all the research done today. And then we're gonna de deconstruct this. Because we don't need it. And then we can put up, let's do this because we can do some of it. We'll do it until we don't have any more. Uh, and then we're gonna make this until we don't have any more of that. And then this, we're gonna make a fried mush bar. Let's queue that up too. Cool. Okay, these guys are doing nicely in here. All right, I like that. So if we are gonna do, um, I think they can reach three above them. And I kind of want to go all the way over to here. So let's go across and down and then back this way and right there and across here and down and then we'll cancel that one. And it, yeah, we'll have to do that. And then we'll go across here. Then we're gonna mine everything out inside. And this is a huge mega project. Which I always get in trouble for making mega projects in my videos. Because we need oxygen now. Yeah, we need to put this back on. We do still have some a good amount of algae. 
Oh, now they're gonna go to sleep into their nasty ox uh, oxygen deprived room. Great. Well, look at that, ox or the, the carbon dioxide pouring down in here and then it's getting picked up and then it's coming back up, it's flowing back that way. And it's flowing over here. <laughs> they're, having, they're having a bad sleep because they can't breathe in their sleep. Oh no, that is not good at all. Because all of the carbon dioxide is flowing down from above. Yikes, sorry about your bad sleep. Uh, we should probably remedy that. And we're out of food now. Hey, okay, mush bar. Tell you what. Let's do some of these. And then they can just eat here. Is that a sign to someone? I think it does. Okay, we're gonna make some more. Oh, just let's just slow it down right now. We have a lot of stuff going on without much being planned. There's the med bay. I don't really care about that. Food. Let's put our planter boxes in. Okay, now do these these get automatically? Oh, they get assigned on their own. We'll have to see about that. And I do want to remove this, so let's uh, take turn that off. Good. We got the water coming in. Building up the tables. Good. Do I have any more seats in here? I don't. Tables are good. Let's do some furniture. Can I do a ceiling lamp? Huh. So those won't work. Interesting. Makes sense, though. They're starting to get stressed out a little bit, too. So we might want to get a massage table in. And another ceiling lamp, I guess. So is it BB, the, the main one that's stressed out? Why? Uh, I don't know. Okay, can I put a, a lamp above you? Would that help a little bit? Probably. These aren't plugged in. I figured they would be just fine. Oh, that's hardly any power. I was concerned that it would be super high powered. That's fine. Build the lights. That should relieve some... And we could... Ooh, sculpting block? Oh! Okay. That's kind of neat. I guess. Man, I don't like having our guys up in there. Auto Dave, what are you doing, buddy? Got plenty of LG for right now. Uh, you know what? We don't need to build this. Yeah, we do. We need to build that top one. We don't need to build these. Oops, wrong button. Or that one. All the way across. We just have to get to it. How did Bert get stuck in there? Bert! 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 How'd you do that? There! Get out! Can't breathe! You ding dong. Here, pick that up. Just a little bit of oxygen left. Man! So let's help people do the artwork and stuff. Oh man, that really takes a long time to build that painting thing. Some more light. These don't have any micro mushers. Does that stop it? Or are there people gonna work on it still? Just cancel it, I guess. Insufficient power, so it sounds like we need another power station. That makes sense, like, I'm at the edge of, of what's possible without doing anything that the game is meant to be played. If that makes sense. We have our massive storage unit, we have our, our big bro room in the bottom, uh, food shortage. Okay, so people should be working on food, we probably need to make a, a dedicated um, cook now. Nobody's a great cook. 
Marcus? You're a good dig machine. Huh. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's uh, prioritize this up. Like a seven. And then we'll prioritize this to a six. So we have two people that are making sculptures too. There you go, Marcus. Ooh, running low on power. Okay. See, now it is it is Mega Project time. It's starting to hurt me again. We have another duplicate coming in. Okay, who do we have today? Gabriel. We have Marie. Elvira. Let's go with Elvira. Yeah. And we're gonna rename Elvira. Monsterpiece. Print you up, Monsterpiece. Okay, uh, now we're in a lot of trouble. Because oxygen is low. We need to get that, the, the water maker. Let's do that. Um, you know what? Thermal regulator. That's actually something uh, to do in the next video. I think we have we have a good system set up. We have this thing that's being made right now. We have a lot of people that are doing work. We have people that are chiseling and doing artwork on the blank canvases. We've got uh, we've got a new good food situation going on, or should be anyway. Marcus is making poop, but BB is out of power. We're out of water. Our oxygen is not doing too great. It's not terrible, but it's not great either. And a uh, good thing is we do have no algae. <laughs> Shoots. Okay, we're in trouble. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.